Chapter 1 Introducing Biology Scope and Branches You are studying biology as a part of science. It therefore becomes necessary to define science first. Science is an organized body of knowledge supported by observation and experimentation derived from the study of natural phenomena of the entire material universe. There are three major branches of science, namely physics, chemistry and biology. Of these, biology is the study of living beings, that is, all plants and animals, including humans. Nowadays, scientists often prefer the term life sciences instead of biology in an effort to emphasize the focus on the study of life processes. However, biology itself means the study or science of life. Greek word bios means life, logos means study. Growth of biology No one can say when the study of biology exactly began. Primitive man lived in jungles and caves. He collected food from natural vegetation and hunted wild animals. Through this activity, he learned about the life and habitats of different animals and recognized various plants and their parts. That was the beginning of biology. The drawings of animals and plants in the caves of prehistoric periods are proofs of primitive man's interest in plants and animals around him. With the evolution of culture, Man began to live in settled communities and started farming. He domesticated animals such as the dog, cow, sheep, horse and buffalo. These practices gave him further opportunities for the study of the ways and life of these animals. Thus, biology advanced more and more. Pioneer of Biology Greeks were probably the pioneers of an organized study of biology. Aristotle, 384 to 322 BC, was the first person to study animals in sufficient detail and he is called the founder or father of biology or father of zoology. Theophrastus, 370 to 285 BC mainly studied plants and is said to be the father of botany. Hippocrates, 460 to 377 BC, rationalized the science of healing and treated the sick. He is called the father of medicine. अगर आप अपने सिलेबस के सारे चैप्टर्स इस फॉर्मेट में देखना चाहते हैं तो हमें डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिए गए नंबर पर कॉल करें डेवलपमेंट ऑफ बायोलॉजी बायोलॉजी हैड फ्लरिश्ड अ ग्रेट डील इन एंशिएंट इंडिया 2500 बीसी टू 650 बीसी वेरियस सिस्टम्स ऑफ क्लासिफाइंग एनिमल्स एंड प्लांट्स वर डेवलप्ड फॉर एग्जांपल जीवज विविपरस animals who give birth to young ones, andaj, oviparous animals who lay eggs, etc. Cultivation of rice was first introduced in India. It is estimated that more than 1,000 varieties of rice had been developed. With the invention of microscope in the 16th century, a new world of minute animals and plants came to human knowledge. The cell as the basic unit of living things was seen through the compound microscope. Biology now began to grow faster. In the 19th century, biology took several major leaps through the discovery of germs, wider acceptance of the theory of organic evolution, establishment of the cell theory, etc. Now, the 21st century is poised to unravel more mysteries of nature and miraculous innovations in medicine and agriculture. Biology has already progressed a great deal in the field of vitamins, 
hormones, genetics, genetic engineering, antibiotics, cancer research, cloning, stem cell research, organ transplant, environmental sciences, life in outer space, etc. The latest is that scientists are planning to create life, some single-celled bacteria, from lifeless material using fatty acids and nucleotides, etc. Branches of Biology Biology is divided into several branches. This division can be made in at least three different ways. A. In terms of major kinds of organisms, botany, the study of plants, zoology, the study of animals, human biology, the study of human as a living organism and his relationship with other living organisms. The study of humans and their interaction with the society comes under anthropology. Greek anthropos means man, logos means study. अगर आप अपने सिलेबस के सारे चैप्टर्स इस फॉर्मेट में देखना चाहते हैं तो हमें डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिए गए नंबर पर कॉल करें बी इन टर्म्स ऑफ स्पेशल ग्रुप्स ऑफ ऑर्गेनिज्म बैक्टीरियोलॉजी द स्टडी ऑफ बैक्टीरिया वायरोलॉजी द स्टडी ऑफ वायरसेस माइकोलॉजी द स्टडी ऑफ फंगी फाइकोलॉजी और एलगैलॉजी द स्टडी ऑफ एलगी Entomology, the study of insects. Ichthyology, the study of fishes. Herpetology, the study of reptiles like lizards, snakes, etc. Ornithology, the study of birds. C. In terms of approach on studying it. Anatom. The study of gross structure of the organs in an organism as seen in dissection. Morphology. The study of form and structure of plants and animals. It includes essentially the understanding and interpretation of structure, both external and internal. Sometimes students wrongly consider morphology to be concerned with the study of external parts only. Histology, the study of minute structure of tiny bits of the body of tissue level as seen with the help of a compound microscope. Cytology, the study of structure and function of animal and plant cells. Physiology, the study of metabolism, functions and activities of organisms and their parts. Embryology, the study of formation and development of embryo of plants and animals. Taxonomy The science of naming, grouping and classifying plants and animals. It is also called systematics. Ecology The study of the relationship of an organism to both its biotic, that is living, and abiotic, non-living, environment. Biogeography the study of geographical distribution of plants and animals. Paleontology. The study of prehistoric forms of life through fossils of plants and animals. Evolution. The study of origin and descent of organisms. Genetics. The science of the transmission of body characteristics, both similarities and differences from parents to offspring. Parasitology, the study of parasites, the organisms that live on ectoparasites or inside endoparasite, other organisms and draw nourishment from the hosts. Pathology, the study of diseases of plants and animals. Immunology, the science that deals with the phenomena and causes of immunity, resistance to or defense against diseases. Eugenics, the science which aims to improve the human race through controlled heredity. 
for example, discouraging a marriage that is likely to show unfavorable or harmful characters in children. Biochemistry Study of chemicals and reactions that take place inside the living things. One of its numerous applications is DNA fingerprinting. अगर आप अपने सिलेबस के सारे चैप्टर्स इस फॉर्मेट में देखना चाहते हैं तो हमें डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिए गए नंबर पर कॉल करें ऐसे ही और एजुकेशनल वीडियोस देखने के लिए हमारे चैनल होम रिवाइज को सब्सक्राइब करें